Okay, this is our latest clever tool. It's just really to help you get um, perfect 45 degree mitre corners. So, piece of black card. Now, each side there's an, there's an etched line there and an etched line there. That's just really just to help you line up on the edge of where your um, slot begins. Okay, so we'll just do that across there. You can use a trimmer. You can cut there, okay, and that over, and you've got a perfect mitre, okay. Now you can see that I turned it over. If you've got strips of decorative paper that you want to mitre, um, it helps if you have a a craft mat with measurements on. So just for argument's sake, we'll pop this here. We'll pop this here. So these are random pieces. Okay, now I want to try and match the pattern as much as I can. So because these are from scraps, so I'm looking at a piece that, right, I'm going to follow that flower there, and I'm going to go on there, and I'm using the mat because that's making sure that I'm straight when I'm laying it, lining it up. Okay, I'll just put that there. And I'm going to take my tool, line it up, line it on there. Oops. Draw my line. Uh, my craft knife. Oh, my ruler has disappeared. It's here. Okay, I'm going to cut that across there. And then hopefully let me take that off, it's not cut through. Okay, take that one off, take that one off, and then you've got your mitre's corner there. It doesn't match up perfectly, as I say, because it's different pattern papers, but you get a pretty accurate thing going across really? like that. 